You might not know her by name, but if you have ever read any of the Harry Potter books, you probably already know the work of illustrator, author, and artist Mary Grand Pre. Born in 1954 in South Dakota and raised in Minnesota, Grand Pre discovered her creative side at an early age while drawing pictures with her father. After earning a BFA from Pomona College, she enrolled at the Minneapolis College of Art and Design. Originally, Grand Pre intended to study painting, but decided to go in a different direction when she discovered her talent as an illustrator. She went through growing pains early in her career. Work was hard to find and she was still searching for a style to distinguish herself. When she did get jobs, mostly with local ad agencies, she became immersed in the work and her portfolio grew. Eventually, her own style emerged, a style she refers to as soft geometry, characterized by straight lines, sharp angles and curves, her art is always hand-drawn and is almost exclusively colored with pastels. After several years of doing advertisements, she decided to illustrate children's books. To break into the business, she solicited New York publishing houses until she received her first contract in 1993 with Random House to illustrate Chin Yu Min and the Ginger Cat. By 1997, she had become an established storybook illustrator with several titles to her name when she received a call that proved to be life-changing. It was Scholastic. The offer was to illustrate a children's book about a boy with magical powers named Harry Potter. Was she interested? With plenty of projects to keep her busy, Grand Pre turned it down. But after a little convincing, she reconsidered. Grand Prey received no direction from Harry Potter author J.K. Rowling other than the manuscripts provided. The sketches she submitted were a hit with Rowling and Scholastic and she was asked to illustrate the next two books in the series. With the release of the third book, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban in 1999, Potter mania was sweeping across the United States. Her illustration of Harry Potter even appeared on the cover of Time magazine. Grand Prey's artwork was many readers' first impression of the young wizard in the magical world of Hogwarts. On a whim, she created the iconic Harry Potter logo with the lightning bolt motif that is on every piece of Harry Potter merchandise from movie posters to lunch boxes. Among her other works, Grand Prey has illustrated more than 20 storybooks. The noisy paint box, the colors and sounds of Kandinsky's abstract art received a 2015 Caldecott honor. She has also authored the books Henry and Paul with artist and husband Tom Kasmer and Leonardo, the Little Inventor. A Sarasota resident since 2003, today Grand Prix channels her passion for light, color, and drawing into evocative fine art paintings that combine the abstract with realism. Because of her distinguished career illustrating the characters and sceneries of storybooks with her timeless and strikingly vivid style, and for her iconic Harry Potter illustrations that continue to spark imaginations and inspire new generations of children to love reading, the Florida Division of Arts and Culture proudly inducts Mary Grand Prey into the Florida Artists Hall of Fame.